There we go. Okay. We're good. Yeah, I'm gonna go do that thing. Good thing. Yeah, I'm that managed communities thing. things like you told me about. Where you can start I with think... your own character. Mm. Did you do the tutorial yet? No, I don't think so. I just clicked the thingy. Uh, I don't know if it'll let you if you haven't did the tutorial. But yeah, I, I don't know. I just clicked it. I just go ahead. Just go ahead. These people, what? I what? can be a Diego. Wait, I can choose from these people? Oh my god, that guy looks like fucking, like, a black version of, uh, uh, not Steven Seagal, fuck, I forget what that dude's name is. <laughs> so I can just, like, keep scrolling till I find a team Second. that I like. Ah, uh, yes. Did you pick that one chick with, like, the leather jacket? Uh, like, is it, are you selecting out of the two characters? One character and one partner yes. character? I did the, pro, like, the couple. Diego and what's her face? The two females. Now the two females. Uh, okay, I don't even know who I want to play. A lot of these characters look like shit. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, they look pretty bad. <laughs> so wait, can I, like, be the partner character? This is true. Or no? Uh, you can, once you do the tutorial. Scene and Charlie. These characters look like shit. Fucking, I'm just gonna be that guy. He has a plaid shirt. I'm gonna be Diego. But yeah, if you're able to customize that, I don't wanna try it. <laughs> yes, I'm a Mexican, man. You gotta do the, you gotta do the tutorial first, and then when you go to manage communities and make a new community, you skip the tutorial and then give you three uh, character slots. So is and you can just randomize each character so you like. So is this any different from the first game, like, or it, is it just the first game with what do you call it? Like, I, I'm not talking story um, wise. <laughs> I'm talking. There is some story relation to the first game, but like, it's stated DK, but... Just, uh, just now it's it? multiplayer, and it's four-player co-op now. Yeah, pretty much, but there's like a little bit more resource managing and, and base building. And it's actually, uh, the whole morale thing actually matters. I don't know, it's much more in-depth than what the original I'm was. I'm not to shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> I love it, oh, bro, the ones weren't better. And now I'm slapping them with a bat. Give me a little whap whap. It's, it's State of Decay 2, just State of Decay, but more in-depth. What, what's this grab button? Yeah. Like, I've been, like, trying to grab zombies. What the hell? Looks the like RT. Yes. You can only grab zombies from behind or if they're on the <laughs> you ground. You can only take them from the back. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so is searching even uh, important or no? Yes. Fast searching penalizes you greatly, unlike I'm the guess, first one. Oh, yeah. I forgot about fast searching. Oh, and blow people, I forgot to introduce ourselves, it doesn't really matter. I'll just put your thing in the, uh, in the title next time, or, like, when I get done doing this. I'm just a person. But yeah, we, we both played State Decay 1 a lot. I didn't really play that much of, like, the military DLC, because I wasn't really too big of a fan of it. It wasn't that great, in my I, opinion, but hey, it was still I liked this. Uh, because there, there were two DLCs. There was that one, then I think there was the one after the game, right? Um, there was like there was two. There was like hard one, and then there was another DLC. Yeah, breakdown. breakdown was good. I I played a fuck ton of Breakdown. So did I. I got to like Breakdown twelve before just making a new save. Like I said, I thought it was good. But yeah, this lady that I have with me, she has a, uh, she has, like, a biker jacket with, like, all, like, studs and stuff, and it's like, that's cool. 
I just picked this Diego guy because he has a plaid t-shirt. Everybody else looked pretty gay, I'm not gonna lie. I'm debating whether if you get to the multiplayer part to play as the god mode character that I have glitched. By How do you even, like, yeah, but I don't get that though. Like, how's it even, like, glitched? I don't know, it's just like, I finished the game and then she just became freaking godly and never got tired or injured. Maybe that's just her thing. Like, she can take damage, obviously, right? Yes, but she has, like, 250-something health. Are you even able to join as your character? Like, that, that was the thing that I was wondering about the- Yes, I am. Um, about this game. I can choose- I can choose my communities and play as any of them I want. So do I just get a basic combat knife, or did I- do my dude just randomly find this? You always have a close range weapon and a melee weapon. The close range is only meant for if you don't have a melee weapon. Hmm, interesting. So yeah, you can just have like this miniature combat knife thing. So you're, so you're just yes, not and there's shit even freaks. a specialization perk. Hey, check out these notes. There's even a specialization you know, perk for, for it to make it even better than a melee weapon. Which is okay. pretty nice. You can write one for me then. Oh my god, my dude sounds so Mexican, it's pretty funny. Let's just keep moving. <laughs> Not like it's a bad thing, it's just funny. Not like it's a bad He's like stereotypical Mexican guy. Oh, the character names in this game are ridiculous as well. This is Diego. I've seen a character named Barf. It's literal bark. B A R F. Do they have shark suit guy? Yeah. Uh, yes, I think so. I have one with a. I have a guy with a bat hoodie. That's pretty cool. Cause yeah, in the first game, it was like he plays a black dude with the, uh, with the another thing, and he was pretty cool. I just played him because I liked his whole costume design. Yeah, there's a ton of like. Animal hoodies that you can get. Uh, any character customizations, or are you like, you're just stuck finding the person how you find them? No, it, you find the person how you find them. Uh huh. Mm, okay, interesting. Yeah, I'm just like walking through that base right now. Like, I don't know if searching is like really even important as of right now. Like, I don't know if this is gonna pull a survive and just take all my shit away from me, but yeah. Does it do that, or does it not do it? Do what, Tario? Space Uh, map. you know how Metal Gear Survive, like, takes your shit after the first thing? The hell is this place? Mm. Do, does it do that, or no? No, it does not. It does not take your stuff. Okay. But yeah, I would have played this a lot earlier, but, eh, I had too much stuff I had to do. But yeah, all that stuff's gone, so I'm happy. We we just got That's our car good. fixed yesterday and it was good. Just got our car fixed yesterday and it was good. Relaxation time. Yep. Yeah. Also, I personally think they need to like adjust the difficulty or the damage modifiers to zombies because they do little to nothing. Except the plague zombies, when they grab and bite, that's bad. Okay, I can't save this person, she's being bit. Okay, well there we go, now I saved me. He's just like that muerto we saw inside Oh the my gate. god. This is a dude. Yeah. We both had worse. Yeah, sure. This is a dude I'm playing though, he's something. Dude, I'm playing though. He sounds like every like stereotypical Mexican guy. It's pretty good. I have an Australian lady. Nice. She's pretty cool. How do you even fast searching? Oh, uh, wait. Fast searching is like LB, right? Yep. Okay. I really don't want to play this guy. I want to do that thing you were talking about, like getting different characters. And, like being able to choose the character you, you want. Gotta, I, I know, I'm, I'm, I'm doing the. Like, it's nice to talk to you. I would invite you, but I don't think you can join me. Nope. 
Also, um, when you do the whole start a new community thing, it will put you in a random map and you do not get a choice, unlike when you do the tutorial. Nah, I don't really care. I would rather pick my own character, fuck the map, I don't yeah. give a shit, really. <laughs> I really don't. It, it can be randomized for all I can. I just, I really hope you don't get the plateau. Uh, what's wrong that with map. the plateau? Um, most of my friends chose that map, and it's just, like, high ground desert with barely any towns. Oh, so there's really not that much to do. I'm sorry. It has one city, and that's in the middle. I just don't like the two characters I have. Like, every character that I was able to choose between, it's just like I really didn't like. I just picked this dude because of plaid hoodie. Yeah, that's all. Like, at least with Marcus in the first game, it was just like I liked Marcus. Marcus was cool. Like, Maya. Maya was cool, too. Oh, look at that. Cinematic angles when I smack a bitch's face in. Sweet. Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't think Black Ops 4 is that bad. Everybody hates it because no no co-op and no 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 story. It's like meh. That was never really a Call of Duty thing. Yeah, it's okay. I can see for somebody that wants to actually like play the story or have a story, it's disappointing. But legit, when most people buy it, it's for multiplayer. Bandages, camp thingy. Ooh, I got a machete. Then again, the two Call of Duties I even like are actually you'll, hated. You'll like, like, I, like fucking yeah. Black Ops 4 then. They added back taunting with with your your hands and shit. It's not the taunting, it's just like... I don't know, Treyarch games don't interest me. Have you even seen the new trailer? I like... Dude, Dude, I have. I dude, have seen some dude wiggled his fingers too. around too. I don't know if it was supposed to be special or something like that. But yeah, he wiggled his fingers around, so I think they added that. But yeah, you liked the one Call I just of like Duty Infinite because Warfare it was. And uh, ghosts. Yeah, well, yeah, that game looks a lot like Infinite oh. Warfare in a way, because, like, you can see health bars and weird shit like that. Like, it, it looks odd. It doesn't look like... It doesn't look that bad. What just bothers me about Black Ops 4 is just, like, at first glance, you would just think of Black Ops 3. I just like a lot of the characters they have now. Like, I really like the shield dude. There's another dude that I like too, where you're able to like crouch and like make a like a thing, like a barrier, I, like how Titans do. That's pretty cool. It's just like when I looked at it at first, I thought it was. Just, I actually like, a had Black to Ops like skin, re. But I'm pretty sure it's much more. I had to depth. like rewatch it again and just like kind of cut it down like bit by bit. I've been, I've been hearing people get copyright striked for doing that. But also, to my my review slash thing, I didn't really shit on the game that hard. I honestly thought it looked kind of interesting, and you know, hearing somebody like me that's like all all solo, like single player co op guy, be like that actually looks good. Like that's kind of different. Oh, it's a screaming zombie from the first game. No, 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 never. Like, there's always gonna be people's opinions oh, that think differently and just think you're always wrong or always right about the game. Mm -hmm. Like I said, I think the game doesn't look that bad. It's like, you know why they took out the so single player, right? Like, uh, why, not, why have a single player if only 20% of people play it? This is true. You're just, like, th think about it, real talk, it's like... You spend the money on getting these voice actors to voice act for a thing that only a few people will play. Everybody will be playing the multiplayer. It makes no sense. Wait, what are you doing here? The last evac trucks left days ago. 
My girl heard the army ran these camps. Oh, so I guess everybody we pick is some type oh, of couple. To close these camps down and move on. Cuz uh, Diego was just like, so. yeah, my girl. Just a few of us dumb enough to stay behind. I think you would like this trip. Uh, I don't know, cuz there's okay. there's siblings no and there's uh the Best, best buddies or whatever. People that day. Yeah. Oh, okay. And then there's the two lesbians. What's wrong? This is bad. Real bad. We need serious help. Doc should still be down at the s and this, this doesn't actually play that bad. I kind of expected this game to turn out. It's actually like, kind of nice. And like, sad to say. Okay, yes, thank you for your help, oh, man. Yeah, of course. Yeah, I thought this game might have turned out like survive yeah, I and just, you know, didn't do that great. But yeah, it's it's not bad. I like it. But, yeah, it's, it's you can even move map to map if you get sick of the map you're cool. in. See, that's pretty cool. Like, all the maps are like randomized, right? Or are they not all randomized? Uh. No, they're all, they're all the same, but the Where loot inside them are random. I thought civilians mm. had been gone okay. for days. Still trying to be. Was your friend bitten? That's my girl. But each of them are There's pretty the big. Blood on the outside. I'm so sorry. You should come with me. Oh God, that's what bit me. One of those uh, things. Give me a minute. Yeah, it's all good. It's called blood plague. It's very yeah. contagious, and it doesn't take long to do its job. What do you mean? That's gonna happen to me? Not as long as I'm around. Hey, I could use your help. Sure, person. Take your flashlight, go in there and look for a sample case. I need you to bring it to me. Before I lost my team, we were learning all we could about blood plague. So they get infected by being never done. But it only works if you use it soon after infection. The army took our lab when But yeah, it seems like this game has done a lot of really cool stuff. As in, uh... Like, if you fast check, you're not gonna get as much loot, and... You know, I think that's really cool. I like that they fix that. Since my, uh, since my friend's AFK, it's like... Yeah, I gotta, gotta keep talking. Did you find it? Here you go, person. Take the thingy. No cure? I'll need an infirmary to culture a new dose. Hey, Doc, it's checkout time. Fucking Zeds are swarming the perimeter. Plague zombies, too. I know you want to save Amari, but it's time for us to bounce. Amari's the reason we have a treatment. Exactly. Don't let that legacy die here. Other survivors are going to need your help. Like her. Okay. But I can't just leave. Not like this. Do what you need to. I'll make it fast. I'm sorry to ask this, but I need your help. I'm going to save your girlfriend if I can. Because no one deserves what happened to Amari. But I don't have the strength to... Oh, do, do her in. Don't worry, lady. I got this. Accepted. Challenge accepted. <laughs> Alright, lady. I'm sorry. This is gonna suck. Wait, how, how... Okay, wait, no, I, I can just equip. Look at that, okay, cool. Bang. May God watch over you. Ah, he should have just laughed and said, bang, you're dead. I know I have a hard time letting people take care of me. For what it's worth, I'm glad we're together. Don't worry, I ain't doing the apocalypse without you. Thank you for doing what I couldn't. We gotta decide something before we go. Okay. Hmm. I wanna make my character, or I wanna get like a different character though, whatever, head for the valley oh, then. Yeah, cool, yeah. I'm riding shotgun. I hope your driving is good. Hmm, okay. <laughs> Man, it has been a while since I played a game like this. No more army, huh? So And I'm back. Oh my god, wait, why are all the doors open? Oh my god. 
<laughs> Why do they just keep opening the door? Okay, that that was an interesting Wait, start gone? to State of Decay. I I opened the door. I shot I shot the lady in the face, and we left. Oh yes. And now we have the doctor person. And this yep. dude was just, he said Maggie. something like he said something in like to to the zombie, and I got upset. He just should have been like bang, you're dead. Upset. Said some goofy shit like that, but yeah, I want to like change my character and do that stuff. Yeah, once you get into the, I pick the valley, like where it says, the oh the valley. I haven't seen that map much. But I want to change my person though. <laughs> once, once it tells you you can play multiplayer, all you gotta do is exit the game and go to manage community. Okay. Yeah, no, this, uh, yeah, this game's good. Yeah, I like it. They definitely made the, the whole, like, combat a lot more smoothing. I, yeah, I mean, that's a huge jump compared to what the original was and then what this is. Definitely. Damn, out of gas. Guess we better start scavenging. Since State of Decay, the original one was, uh, indie start. Is this game still technically an indie game? Uh, I don't know. Oh, I've literally never felt worse in my life. I already hate my girlfriend. Yeah, she said said down. literally. I now. hate that word. God damn it! <laughs> I, I I think this game's still considered an indie game. It's definitely a lot better than an indie game though. Like they uh yeah like there's there's so much more. Compared to the first At least game. Undead Labs is an indie company. This could be considered a AAA. Okay, now it says I can do it. Um, private friends only. I saw a decent home and then right I'm quitting we because gas. I want to make a character. <laughs> and then I'll invite you. This is what we've been waiting for to to this play this together. You get three characters. You can hit random on all of them to select. I want to be no goddamn Diego. <laughs> no Mexican man. No, I do not want to be Mexican man. So wait, so what do I do? Do I delete the community, or do I just go to one of the other save files? I... Oh wait, this game has save files too. I would just go to. Yes, you get three save files. Okay, then I'm going to second save file. Skip the tutorial. Skip. More games need to have fucking save files, okay. goddammit. You know, that's another thing that I get really upset about with a lot of games. Some games just don't have fucking save files. You know, a game that should have had save files? Far Cry 5. Yeah, so you can just start a new campaign. Or get a new game plus. Over again, just experiencing it. Heck yeah. Uh, I don't know what I'm looking for. Or what I'm looking to do. Well, just do anything that you think is right. Well, what's a good, uh, what's a good start for a character? Mmm. You could always find a character that's like high pain tolerance or can take a punch. If you got a character with that trait, they'll have high health and good at fighting. Uh, or resilience. Resilience is a good one. Good crafter loves riding bikes. Okay. Let's see what you mean about this. Like, the first person I get, that's the person who I'm gonna probably be flying as, right? Uh, I think it randomly picks who you play as at the start. I don't know if this person's a man or Of the three? I don't know if this person's a man or they're fighting is like off the Well, what's their name? Kylie. Sounds like a lady name, Kylie Washington. And she has like massive for fighting. Probably. 
It's probably a lady. Probably. It's fucking traps all the goddamn time. <laughs> this is true. Oh. I can't find a person I like. I can't find a person I like. Craft. Be a black guy with the squid hoodie. What's his name? I wanna get that guy. <laughs> uh, I don't know. It's all randomized. Sounds like a pussy to me. Oh my god, that Asian dude, bro. He is like master of wits. Everything else is not good. Uh, there's a black guy. He's stylish. Yeah, and ready for any stylish. Thing. Ready for anything. These people got some really weird faces. Look people good. got some really weird faces. Sorry, this is taking a bit. Like, I'm looking for people. Oh, that person has a hoodie. That person has That's cool. I'm gonna keep that lady because she has a like, cool. Yeah, it took me about 30 or an hour to find the perfect <laughs> Are you team. Me? Are you me? No, I'm not. I'm not kidding you. Okay, people, this might take a little bit. I'm sorry. Actually, I'm not. I don't want to look like somebody stupid. I actually want to find a person I like. <laughs> And at least you guys can see all of the cool stuff. That person's stuff's good, holy shit. Cardio's up, wits is up, fighting's okay, shooting's good, and cooking's okay. Cooking's a good skill. As well as mechanics what about gardening? and gardening. Because I got utilities and gardening. Also, it wouldn't hurt to have a doctor as one of your starting team. Brian. I don't know, wait, what do you mean, doctor? Like, someone who's, like, good with medical. Mechanical shooting, fighting. Oh my god, look at that black dude, that black dude looks cool. His, is called, his name's called Superstar. <laughs> Hated camping. Yeah, I kind of wish that I could just, like, make my yeah, own person. <clears throat> yeah, but hey, at least it lets you randomize into a character you like. It's the least it could do. Wait, I can throw knives if I get that guy? But I can throw knives if I get that guy. I don't think it's so. It's a knife thrower. I think that helps with shooting. Yeah, because his fighting is at 4, and his other thing is at 4. Yeah, it helps with shooting and fighting, I guess. Oh my god, that one person. Oh, that person looks cool. Why can't I find any of these fucking people? Why can't I find any of these people? I don't even know if that's a lady or a man. It's Hayasa hey Downey. He's got like a hoodie over their head. He's got like a hoodie. Barber and no slightly clue. sneaky. I don't know, I like that person's design. I like the cut of their jib. Barber is a good one. I think that helps with morale. Ah, okay. Uh, woodcutter, spry. I don't want to lose Cletus there. So what are like the other good perks that you said? Computers. Yeah, I'm just going to keep fucking randomizing. Uh... Okay, there we go. That dude's good at medical. I'm keeping you on my team. Like, go ahead and shoot. Like, if his medical like, is all the way up, does that mean it's really good and he can help people? Yeah, mm, helps helps people recover from injuries quicker. I kind of want to keep this person well, because no, they have a hoodie and they look cool. But I don't know if that's the best thing. They yeah, have one for everything, and their fighting is at four. Like, the other dude I found was much better. 
Each character can be good as long as you play them and upgrade their skills. Our wit's good. Helps you with searching. Because this dude's got... Searching quicker. This dude that I found that has, like, a hoodie... Dude that I ...has, like, max wits, and his mechanical is not half bad. I say he's a good Grusher, choice. Grusher, always cold, and... Scrapyard worker. Ah, fuck it. Yeah, let's do it. Wait, no. I mean, yes, do it. Yeah, okay. That's cool. So I should be able to invite you now, right? Yep. I think I'm in the valley again. And we're that would be awesome, because I haven't got to play on that Looks map like, much. yeah, no, it is the valley. Sweet. Not me. Last time, I accidentally stumbled on a juggernaut. I have a better idea. We could settle down here instead of moving on. I admit, it looks better than the last couple of towns we came through. Now that you I actually know, really like how they did this game. Kind of feel home. It's settled. There's a lot of other cool stuff. Like you can even assassinate the juggernauts and fire. Yeah, I just heard about this dude talking about yeah, juggernauts. Juggernauts are mean. Unless you encounter two ferals, and then that's scary. I actually like the people that I pick. They're not bad. I like that other person too, but I think on my own. On my own time and like when I'm not recording, because I just stopped and restarted again. Uh, yeah, uh, I, th I think I'll probably keep messing around and looking for stuff. Yeah, I like the group I have. One dude's good with mechanical stuff, and or this is people are good with things, and that's what I like. And I wanted to keep that guy with the hoodie because I I, I, I wanted to see a dude with a hoodie. I do want to say something, and that is beware of ladders, because they don't always work. What do you mean? The ladders don't always work? Um, a lot of the ladders on billboards, if you try to walk to get on them, they just, get my invite. just walk over them and then you fall. Yeah, it is, it's loading. Oh, hello there. And then, like, you sprain your ankle or fracture your disc and it just sucks. I got a big old fucking backpack. Yeah, your person has a hoodie. Invisible doors. My my dude has a hoodie. So yeah, we can just search all this stuff, right? Um, so in multiplayer, you can only search stuff that corresponds to your color, and you're yellow. Interesting. But I got a big old fucking backpack. I just found it in there. So yeah, you said fast searching is not the best. Uh, until unless you get the stealth skill, and then that helps a lot. You can you, you can get, see why I picked a this you guy. Can get stealth. He has long hair and somewhat of a beard. It's like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and his skills were kind of mix matched Wait, and all around. Am I able to switch my character? Oh, hey. Oh, uh, no, I can't switch my character. I was gonna show you the guy in the bat hoodie. That'd be cool if you were able to give people characters and stuff like that. Do you wanna leave and pick that it's guy? Like nah, let's just go find a new home. And we sure. Can. I still wanna look around if that's cool. So, that's does fun. this game still work like how, food and ammo in this how the other one works? Like. When you leave, Must have when been you nice. leave, you start losing some shit. No, the game does not play on its own when you're off of yeah, it. Yeah, because remember, that's how the first game was. That's what annoyed the piss out of me about the first yes. game, because it was just like, I collect everything, I'm at max stats, and then it's like, I come back like a day or two later, and all my shit's gone. It's like, what the fuck, man, come on. <clears throat> yeah, get in the back. I'm stuck in the truck, help! I'm in the ground now. I'm, 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 I'm under the map. I can't drive. <laughs> Why doesn't the car move? It's out of fuel. 
Oh. <laughs> Do you want an invite back? I'm actually stuck! I look like a fucking idiot. I'm in the ground. I'm in the ground. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I think you. Do you see yes, this? Yes, I or do no? see this. Can we push the car? Yep. Yeah, I'm actually stuck. Okay. Wanna try coming back then? Yeah. Alright. State of decay. It's and broken that's as hell. State of decay. It's broken as hell, but I still want to keep playing because this game's good. I like it. I'm gonna play Brian instead of Missy. So yeah, some of these cars we can't drive? Okay. Not even three minutes in and I already got stuck in the map. Yeah. yeah. Well, I guess we just jogged down there. I, I was kind of dumb thinking that I would have even been able to uh, drive that vehicle, but, yeah. Yeah, I, I like that other way of picking characters. Like, I did like seeing the whole tutorial. Why the hell Hi there. did it put me up here? <clears throat> you okay? Oh, that's garbage. I don't like the fucking button for running. Here's my character. Oh, that's cool. What's up? That's really cool. I like that. I want that guy now. Did you randomly get that guy, or did you find him? Yeah, I randomly got him. Cool. In the whole random selection thing. I have to go do that later. Yeah. Like I said, there's multiple animal hoodies you can get on any type of character. I really don't like the run button. It's always been like that, though. I know. But you know why I don't like it. My control is broke. Can you hear that? Oh, uh, yeah. That's pretty bad. Yes, that's my left bumper. It's not all the way broken, but it's just broken enough. Actually, I gotta fix it. Oh, this isn't the valley. This is the foothills. Oh, boy. Oh. Because this just look like the valley to me. This is the map I beat the game on. Ooh. So when you collect shit, does that mean I get it too? Uh, no. Anything I find belongs to me except rug sacks. Anything I... Any Unless I drop it for you. Okay. Because I can just go ahead and put you anything I have from my own inventory. I recklessly searched and I got an achievement for it. That guy's name is Cletus. The guy who I'm playing as, yes. I saw his name and I was just like, sure, it's Cletus. Best. It's better than T.Y. Oh, did you find somebody that's name was just Ty? Yep. I actually like my dude's voice too, it's not that bad. Eh. Over here, eh. Shambling assholes. How do you do that? Wrong thing. How do you do that? D pad left. <laughs> no, don't call for help. <laughs> what? Cancel search. Oh, I got an achievement for it. <laughs> <laughs> Just shot a fucking flare in the sky. <laughs> what what happens when that happens? Does that mean random people can start joining or what? Yep. Okay. Well, I canceled the search, so we probably won't find the car now, will we? Not for a bit, probably. Oh, yeah. So, do you like run a lot on this game, or do you not? I think running makes you tired quicker. It does. Okay. 
I guess no stealth killing. No. <laughs> there, hit her. <laughs> okay, where that works. Okay, I, yeah, I guess running also too can get you caught by the zombies. Interesting. Time to get this shit done. I didn't mean to do that. Sure, just just boot that door open. All right. Uh, what, whatever. <laughs> God damn it. It's not what I wanted to do. This is the perfect camera angle. I see nothing and I'm killing things. <laughs> I like that my dude has an axe. Yeah, I really gotta check that shit later. Cause yeah, I don't care about really doing that Diego campaign. I didn't really like the characters I had. Nah. <laughs> Diego and them could die and it wouldn't matter. If I can't find a dude with a cool fucking hoodie, I'm taking it. I don't care. <laughs> I really don't. Now what do I do? What, what do I do? I'm, uh, point at you. Oh, there we go. That's what I do. Yes. Yes, that's what I want to do. Cool, so now I have a base. So can I tell, like, my people to stay back so it's, like, only me and you? Because I don't feel like losing them. Uh, I, I think they can sit here and just do nothing now. Sweet. So, now, okay. Now, now here's another thing. How do I drop all this fucking garbage? Man, storage. You go to the supply locker. No, not storage. You go to the supply locker right here. Yeah, because, like, I collected a lot of stuff. Then you just go ahead and do it. Okay, sweet. Achievements after achievements, because why not? So we need ammo and gas. This is true. Uh, back at the other truck, there was ammo and food. Yeah, I might go... Oh, wait, does this game replenish? After we quit playing, or does it not do that? Because I remember that's what the old game did. Whenever you would log like, off. What do you mean as replenish? You, you were able to search some areas again. Or did they change that? No, it does not. Oh, okay. So if you loot an area, you'll Unless loot an area. Unless I don't area. notice it, and I'm just retarded. I still had some stuff over there, so... So yeah, when I was carrying that big red thing, what, what was that for? I had like a big green backpack on my back. Is that like those red things that uh, I could share with you? Oh, it's No, you can't share rug sacks. Whatever's rug sacks in your world, those are all yours. Okay. Yes, give me all this stuff. Now we play the game of constantly searching for stuff. Heck yeah. Like I said, I love this game. It's still good. Ooh, I found a toolbox. Oh, I got another rucksack. That was the thing that I but loved here. It can be pretty fun. Oh, so I could make this place. Oh, hi there. <laughs> you just phased inside of me. <laughs> wow, wow. Yeah, I got the truck working. Cool. I like how all the cars look like shit on this game. We're all like beaten and battered. It's this. Yeah, you can repair it to make it look brand new. Interesting. Here, stop us here. If the car is parked and you go into the back of the trunk, you can transfer with it all of it. All the stuff in it instantly to the storage and locker. Can you? Oh, cool. Yep. 
How do you just change your character? Are you able just to do that on the fly while you're playing with me? Only, in, only when I'm back at base or in an outpost. So you said if I put all of this crap at the back, this will all go to my base. If you press the right stick, yes. Or not the right stick, shit. Um, the right trigger. They made this game so much better. That was such an annoying fucking thing with, like, the original game. It was, like, bring in all this garbage and, you know, yeah. Yeah, they made that a lot better. Cool. There's a lot of quality of life things that I really like that they did. Alright, here, where you want to go, champ? If you look at the top right of your screen, it tells you what you need to do, and if you follow the orange arrow, that's your next mission objective. I have to climb the nearby tower and do things. I want to explore and do stuff. Oh yeah, our guns still kind of mount in this game. Uh, well, ammo's... Ammo's pretty plentiful. And guns are pretty nice. I have. Like I said, the difficulty in this game kind of needs to be adjusted a bit, in my opinion. I'm just surprised they don't have, like, a harder oh, game mode. Like how, um, how Far Cry has. Like, the other thing that I thought Far Cry would have been good at doing was, uh... I feel if they have New Game Plus, they need to make it harder. Do it like Dark Souls. I wouldn't even mind it. Make... I hope they bring Breakdown back in this game. Oh, just as a basic mode. Yeah, that should just be a thing. Like, what happens, like, when you beat beat the game, like, I don't, not like story things, because people will probably get upset if you spoil story. Like, can you still, pl mm. can you still play at the end of the game? That's what I'm asking. No, once you beat the game, the community's gone forever. Ah, that's kind of shitty. So then you just make a new one and then play through again. But you can, you just, you can play as the characters from your old community, though. Oh, okay, cool. That is kind of like New Game Plusing. That's interesting. Okay. Yes. Cool. But you can only choose three characters from your old community. To so, play like, with. let's say the, the dude that I'm playing, Kalidus, like, if I get him, like, decent, and, yeah, I could probably do that. Nice. And then beat the game, you can, when you go into the new community screen, you can select them before you start a new one. Definitely something interesting, and I like hearing that. And there is four different stories to this game, and four different endings. Interesting. Because, yeah, I, I didn't want to know, like, story uh, fucking, you know, things. It all really depends on the leader type you choose. Okay, yeah, no, that was the thing that I was gonna ask, too. It was gonna be, like, um... I can't carry any more crap. Here, do you mind driving me back? Because I... And then bring, bring sure, me I back here. I can't bring the vehicle. Can we take this one? No, it's broken. I can go at the truck, but, um... There's so much the shit over here. I did the Warlord, and... The Warlord path was fun. Uh, do you want to explain paths? That. Uh, like, leaders? Mm, yeah, sure. Well, Warlord's all about an armory or making ammo and collecting guns, basically. Being the strongest community in town. Not like bandits. Sheriff is all about... Sheriff is just trying to be like, keep it equal, I'm a I good, think. I'm a good boy. Know. We do good boy things. Yes. Uh, and then there's Builder and Trader, which... I builder no sounds like you're trying to build, like, the best fort to make it the best, and then Trader sounds like you're wanting to, like, trade with every community and... Mm, meat chunks. And make everything nice. Make an economy, nice. basically. P pretty much rebuild the establishment. Okay. To me, I thought probably... I should have fucking threw that yeah, thing in the back, but I didn't do that. 
to me, I think Warlord sounds pretty cool, and Sheriff sounds pretty cool, too. I wanted to do Sheriff because, um, after you beat the game, you get a special starting perk for each new community cool. made, depending on the leader type you beat the game with. I'm not gonna spoil what Warlord does because... I think Warlord will yeah, probably no, be no my... No to know about that. I think Warlord will probably be the thing that I pick. Here, get in. I think you would like it. It's either that or Sheriff. Because the other two sound like, okay, they don't sound like, you know, oh, I'm gonna just jump to wanting to do it. That's another reason why I stopped playing on my old save file, because I only had a Warlord and Builders, and I was like, no thanks, I don't want to do a Builder. So I made this community, and now I have a Sheriff. Cool. I'm guessing you did Builder, or did you not just do Builder? I did not, I just kind of stopped. Okay. It's like, nah, I'm okay. Hey, get in. Uh, alright. Yeah, I need to get deeper into town. What about that survey tower right there? I should probably just do that since I'm here. Or cell tower. Yeah, I should probably just do that since I'm here. I think I think that's what I needed to do. It's just like I was. I, think that's I keep forgetting to take off this big fucking backpack. Don't worry about it. Also, <laughs> we go. playing multiplayer and helping your friends actually rewards you. For Stuff. I've been noticing the loot drops like, like right really now, good on this game, like compared to the first game. The first game, it was like you just get fuck all. Yes. Like there, there was nothing. Like it wasn't yeah. even the fact of oh, it's difficult because there is not that much. It's just like I'm really feeling that there's a lot of there's a lot more things, and I like it. Like loot's a lot better. And if you play multiplayer to help your friends, you get chests that consist of certain levels and it can go up to level 5 as a maximum and it gives you a bunch of free stuff for your community just by helping other people. Cool. Like guns, ammo, workshop mods, stuff like that. Oh, this game brings me back. I love just it. For helping your friend and playing with them. I'm actually like really loving this game. Yeah, this this brings me back. Uh, you, you don't even know how many hours I countlessly fucking spent on the first game. Like, shit, I didn't even know you had that time, but yeah. It's crazy. Like, same. Yeah, uh, this brings me back. Yeah, this brings me back, and it's good. I just like that now you can actually fucking play it with friends now. Like, that makes it, uh, it makes it a lot more fun. Yeah, it's just, this game needs to, needs, like, bug fixing and stat. Mm -hmm. Well, even the bug fixes aren't, like, really that, that bad. Like, I haven't ran into one that's that awful. It's nothing... Some of them are hilarious, but some of them are game-breaking and can get your characters killed. Oh, there's spokes over there. Do some characters have the same name, like that one dude that you were playing? Or like, could I find a guy like that? I don't think you can find someone named Brian Stevens. Such a fucking... It's like a very unlikely chance. Cause yeah, I really want to get a character like that with a hoodie and has a special hoodie. Heck, if even if you did get someone named Brian Stevens, be you might the not same even be person. wearing a hoodie. Yeah. That's kind of the shitty thing, like, I wish I could just see the whole character. Okay, well... Yeah, all the- every bit of character is randomly generated, the voice, the model, the- I'm not really clothes, too disappointed with my guy that I have, like, he's pretty cool. Traits, it's all random. I gotta go switch characters, this one's getting tired. Okay. But yeah, um, there's just bug fixes that are, like, needed urgently, because you get characters that I explained earlier, my, one of my characters basically had god mode at that point. Yeah, no, that's 
an issue with this yeah. game that does need to be fixed. Characters shouldn't just be getting god mode. Like I said, I think it's just probably yeah, an elaborate glitch so. that happened. It happened after I beat the game too, and I don't know why. Should we just leave the car? Yeah, I say we walk. Say fuel. Here we go. It's time to get building. Either a workshop or an infirmary. Would oh wait, before we move on, you should build an infirmary or a workshop. Okay. I, th I, th I think I think an infirmary base. would be much better. You could even, you know, probably build both and clear out the place and repair what you got. Be all that fancy stuff. Why do I do that at? Right here. Uh, if you open up the map and you go to the base tab, you should be able to. Cool. There we go. Outdoor beds. Well, I made an infirmary. I don't know if we should really need outdoor beds, but whatever, I made that. Uh, nah. Outdoor beds make people, make people sad. I'll do that. I go. And sad people causes fights, and when people cause fights, they make people even more sad, and then they could end up leaving. I'm gonna change my dude for a bit. I'm gonna change. Am I stuck in the ground? What the fuck just happened? Oh, I know. I'm here. Alright. I actually kind of like this dude with this hoodie. I like a couple of the people that I have. I like this dude with his blue hoodie. I'm like the male version of your character. This is, uh... Pretty, pretty much. I'm like the male version. That's great. <laughs> There was this uh, lady in my other save, she was like wearing a black and blue leather jacket and it looks so yeah, cool. Yeah, this one chick that I had for the start of the game, uh, she had like a black leather jacket with like spikes on it and I thought you would have had, 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 had that character. <clears throat> yeah, I didn't play as a Mex Mexican man. And his lady. And his lady. We got neighbors over yeah, here. Yeah, we should go talk to them. Yeah, I pretty much am wearing the same outfit you have and everything. I kind of just wanted to level this guy up. Also, wearing wearing a bigger backpack weighs more, and it hinders the amount of stamina is consumed the heavier way. Alright. I kind of wanted to play this dude since he has, like, so decent like, wits. So it's like, uh... You either use a light backpack with only six slots, but you use less stamina overall, or you use a heavier backpack with eight slots, but you stamina quicker overall, type thing. Okay, so yeah. They, uh, okay, I, I get what you mean. This game gets fucking hella dark. That's a good thing. Even at max brightness, it's super dark. They made... And I know a few people that complained about that, but I know that's what they wanted. They didn't want people to just have max brightness. Like, kind of sucks for me, for my, my TV, but it's like I can work around it. They give you a flashlight for a reason. And here's the thing about playing co-op partner, the flashlight doesn't work that well as a co-op partner, and it's, it gets bad. Now, do you not even, like, get a flashlight, or what? I do, but it glitches out, and it's just, it gets blocked by something, and it sucks. So I'm guessing there's just a lot of... Hey, I got something for you. What? 
Ooh. Cool, thank you. There's another item. There you go. What, what did you give me? Cool. Gun. I like this dude that I'm playing. He has decent wits. You should probably equip that weapon I gave you. Wait, how do I do that? Uh. Uh, do you know how to? Open sorry, I'm first? still learning. It's down D-pad. Yeah. So what did you give me? Oh, you gave me like a hunting rifle. Sweet. I kind of want to get rid of this shit before we go because I got a bag. Uh, let's explore the clinic first. Oh, okay. Because my bag's full. That's why I wanted to go. Do you have a rug set? Mm -hmm. Okay. We have some neighbors knocking. I think they're in the other room. Oh god, no. Whap, whap, whap. I, th I think I'm having the invisible zombies glitch happen to me. This game sounds extremely buggy. <laughs> There's a backpack right here if you want it. Yeah, um, sometimes zombies can be invisible, including like frowls and juggernauts, and it sucks. Yeah, that's kind of ridiculous, and that's kind of sad too, like, okay, so... I remember in the first game, it's like, if a character dies, you're fucked, like, you lose that character. How, how does that work on here if you're a co-op character? You lose them out of your community in your own game. Interesting. So yeah, there's still a lot of shit in they here that die. I can't, uh... Uh, let's just leave. How about that? Yeah, I don't have a decent backpack where I can carry, like, a shit ton of stuff. I do kind of want to level up this guy's, like, fighting and other stuff because his fighting's pretty nice. That's that. Next place? I'm on my way back to base. You should be fine. Right? Yeah, I should be good. Yeah, this really makes me uh, makes me want to mess around in the character thing again. Do they still have those dickhead jumping zombies? Uh, like the pharaoh. Yeah, the one. The also, ones that can, like, instant kill you. Yes. They're still around. Also, the game's doing that glitch where I can't deposit rug sacks for you. Now can you not? So you're gonna have to do those on your own. Alright. Do you want to try resetting? I dropped it in the house. Nah, just leave it. It should fix on its own eventually if we keep I was playing. gonna say, you should just throw it in the back of the truck. Oh, I just, I left it upstairs by the storage. I need a bigger backpack. That's an issue I'm running into. Yeah, I can tell that the lighting's really buggy on this game, too. Like, the, uh, another thing, people, this game ain't perfect, but it's still fun, though. How much was this? This was, like... It's mainly the flashlight. This is, like, 40 bucks, right? Like, over here, that's how much it was. It's... It's 30 in U.S. dollars. For the standard edition. I got, like, the special or whatever. And it's 50 for the ultimate edition in US yeah, dollars. Yeah, like, uh... Like, it wasn't bad. Like, th this game's not that bad. I'm enjoying it. It's really fun. You just gotta learn to ignore the bugs and just deal with it. But, you know, it is pretty bad and I still think it needs a patch urgently, but I they'll enjoy get the game to it when it they is. get to it. I do like that you can just pick your own character and do that stuff. That's probably the thing that I like the most. Like, I didn't really I wasn't too fond of the characters that I had to start with. But on here they uh yeah, they, they did good. There is no type of friendly fire in this game, but explosives or fire will affect the any other player in the vicinity. 
And it will affect the, like it will affect those players negatively and hurt their characters. Ah, okay. So fire damage is definitely so, like, something that you're not gonna want to be throwing. Or explosives. That's the only way you can cause friendly fire. Oh my god, I found three strong painkillers? Yes, yes, give me. I do like that this game, you're not attached to the hip, like how Far Cry is. Like, don't don't get me wrong, I love Far Cry, but that, that was kind of an issue with that game. Like, you have to be attached by the hip to your friend. I kind of wish we could speed up time. Make a day. We are attached, but... It's a 400 meteor, or not meteor. A four, 400 oh God, meteor dumb. range. Anyways, it's a four, 400 meter leash against us. It's probably not that bad, though. I can see it. Um, Stand still. I am. I'm standing still. I'm searching stuff. Uh, if you open up your map for a second... This is as far as I can go where my waypoint is from you, where you're standing now. Where is your waypoint? It's the blue marker. Oh, is it that just that big circle right there? That's still that's a yes. I can move. That's, I can move all the way over there. From that's where a you're pretty before it pretty fucking me. big leash. The like Far Cry, it's like you don't even get that. Cool, baby rucksack. Wait, so what's max level for for a thing? Like skill? Yes. It's seven. I think my dude's wits is like six, and I think I just got it to seven. If you get it to seven, you can specialize it and make it even better. Cool. How do I do that? If you open up your inventory menu and press left on the uh, left bumper. It should bring you to the skills tab. I can choose a specialization. Scouting increases, and scouting then, range, enemy detection, or re resourcefulness. Increases capacity. I, th of I think scout would be the best choice. Alright. Alright. Cool. I knew there was a reason I should have- So now, enemies on the mini-map should appear before you see them. Cool. Let's go. Yeah, so like the whole tired system's here and all that yes. other stuff's here too, right? Yeah, so there's also a new trauma system in this game that the original didn't I'm have. I'm guessing like... It's where like... Your friend dies in front of you, you start losing your shit. No, um, there's like, okay, if you get grabbed by a juggernaut, he will pound you in the ground and that'll break your character's ribs, permanently reducing their health until healed. Oh, so there's like an injury system. Cool, cool. Oh, yes. also, sorry people that you this hasn't been like that, uh, what do you call it? Like, action. Action-y, because, you know, they were just, I'm starting. And this is kind of cool, figuring out all this It'll stuff. Only... Oh god. Eh. It will get more, like, hordes and zombies everywhere if we destroy plague hearts. Oh, okay. I don't even know what plague hearts are. But that becomes a hassle and annoying. We'll see if we meet, if we meet the neighbors. I'm sorry, I've been just looting, because this game's really fun just to loot and do stuff. I kind of want to find that one building we were at That's earlier. That's thing, um... Do you know where... You gotta be a person to like resource management and just, you know, like scavenging. I scavenge a lot. <laughs> like, that's why I like this game. You can't just go run and gun and do everything that way. It's Wait, can't I make works. an outpost here? What does outposting do? That's, it's been a while since I've done this. Outposting is very different from Cause yeah, it wasn't thing. like outposting, it was just like bam, you can have people yeah. here, they do their shit. Like if you open up your map mm -hmm. 
and move your cursor over the clinic, you can see outpost effects. Interesting. I kind of want to go to the clinic before I do anything, I too. Because, um... Yeah. I, uh... Yeah, I, I goofed. And didn't search this completely. What did you do? I didn't search it completely because I needed to run back. I'm gonna take that bag, though. Man, the jump is pitiful in this game. Oh, there we go. Okay, that's a better jump. Yes, the jump is not useful whatsoever in this game. Hmm, pills. I got a pill press. I don't know what a pill press is, but I got it. I think that's like... I, I, okay, I sound dumb. Yeah, no, it's probably a way that I can make pills and do things like that. So, can I make this an outpost? I kind of want to make this an outpost. Uh, you can. Uh, or would that... I just don't know what the outpost thing is at. The outpost thing is somewhere in here. I kept getting the message, being able to do a... Found it. Oh, uh, this does not meet requirements. Okay. Okay, so I can't do that one. Probably don't have enough influence for it. Ah, probably. Alright, we're gonna run back and we're gonna continue and head to that other area. But do you have any more insightful things to... ...about this game that I'd probably need to know? Just don't try to focus on playing one character only. That's what I did in the first game. Marcus was my boy, he had everything max it's, uh... it's not a good thing because... If you just focus on one char one or two characters only, the rest are left weak and... Making defenses a lot more other annoying. Other characters are... Yes, and also when you have characters that are injured that takes longer to recover, you won't have anyone to back up to that is strong enough to handle themselves. You'll pretty much be taking more time needing the power level of those people. Yes. And... It's nice to have at least three or four characters maxed out. So you can have backups just in case the characters that's you have what I or like started playing doing. get injured that's or tired. Yeah, that's what I started doing in the other game. Yeah. Like, I had like a group of five that I could do stuff with. The other people, it was just like I really didn't feel like leveling through and I was just able to beat it just with the five being as good as they were. Okay, so let's go meet the neighbors. This game likes to make references from movies and games, by the way, with some characters and how they talk. There's so much more to look at and grab. One of the character missions actually, uh... Quote, Duke Nukem. Uh, wait, should we just keep looting, or what? Uh, let's go talk to the neighbors. Let's meet your neighbors. How does that system work? It's still kind of the same. I scratch your back, I give you stuff. Or is that any different? Yes. Also, um... They can turn hostile and start shooting at us and kill us. Oh. <laughs> okay. What happens if we kill them? Can we loot them? We can loot whatever they were using. Cool. I'm definitely not... They will turn into zombies if we don't blow their head off, though. Cool. Oh, so this game has the whole, uh... Oh, so this game has... The whole fucking, like, walking dead garbage. Yes, whoever dies, if their head was not destroyed, they will turn. And I'm guessing it doesn't... This zombie behind I'm us. I'm guessing it doesn't matter if we're bit or not. Like, that you can just turn just the turn. Nope. Interesting. They, they're, they're doing cool things with this game. So we're all infected in the end. Okay, makes no, sense. All... That That is kind Pretty of much. a trend for that, that is... zombie games like this, so... Hmm. 
But I'm definitely gonna go back into that creator section and try to find the du another dude I like with a fucking animal thing. Just make a team full of animal hoodies. Yeah. Yeah, lady, I, can't, I came on in and I'm looting your garbage. I love it. It's just like, come on in. It's like, yeah, I'm already here. I'm already looting. This zombie isn't dying. I found a zombie I can't kill. Do you need me to come over there and help you? Yeah. I, I can't kill it. There's no zombie. You're aiming at a wall. There's a zombie right here. Oh. Okay. You know what? Just pretend like it's not there. <laughs> you, yeah, you're aiming at a wall. Probably just broke it. I was looking at a zombie, I swear. I'm not crazy. <laughs> sure. It's sure. Get out of the way, Ryan. That's funny, I'm pro Also, the character collision is terrible and we stick to each other like Velcro. Oh, yeah, that was happening a couple seconds ago. I was just inside you for a minute. <laughs> Alright. Hello, person. Uh, learn about survivors. Tray with Enclave. Also, characters react if you point a gun at their face. Ah, uh, okay. Hey there. Just, just thought that was something useful to tell you. The safest way to collect samples is by killing plague zombies. Okay, so There's I have to plague kill plague zombies with that plague whole hearts. Area should be crawling with infected zombies. I don't think I'm ready. You could just destroy the plague heart itself and get a bunch of samples. That's more dangerous. Uh, plague guns. zombies can infect you, you and cause around. your character to die within a certain time limit. I'm sending- <laughs> this is kind of shitty, I'm sending out the one guy that doesn't have many good combat skills. Ah, oh, what better of a way to learn? I can just shoot- I can just shoot him up for you. I don't- it don't yeah, matter. Yeah, I don't want to do that. Mm, but yeah, I kind of want to try doing that plug hard thing. We should do, uh... We should do something a bit- A bit, uh, com like, with combat and stuff. Interesting. I found a car, let's go grab that car. I can definitely tell the day the night cycles yeah. are. Uh, speaking of devil, there's a plague zombie right there. How do I. Oh, yeah, yeah, there we go. I just have to hold it. Can I stealth up on that, dude? Flashlight on, doesn't matter. As long as he doesn't see. Kind of fucking. Oh, God. Nope. These guys can infect you, by the way. Stab him. Got him. I can't do anything. They're. He didn't drop a sample. Ah, okay. The, we gotta go kill that's more. That's what I was gonna ask you if, uh... Oh, not secure yet. Oh, so we could, like, take over this There's place. another plague zombie in here. Bitch. Here. He dropped a sample. I'm going up here before I get mobbed. Now here's another thing that this character that I'm playing as right now. She has food allergy allergies. I can't English. Don't mind me. Yep, no, it's um, all good. But yep, no, it's all good. she has twenty negative max health. So she only has 88 HP. That's severely less than any other character or normal character. So I'm guessing she's a bit difficult. Yes, I have a very fragile character right here. I really want to get a dude with an animal hoodie. That'll be horrible when he fucking dies, but, or if he dies. Alright. Let's let's go. There, there's supposed to be a car around here. 
There's, an, there's a plague zombie right there. Nah, I should probably kill it. Also, you can do a Dark Souls and just roll behind him and grab him. I clunked him in the noodle. Does this fan have anything in the trunk? It has fuel in it. Hold on. Let's go. I'm clearing space. Okay. Ow. Oh, no. Get off me, you fuck. You ran me over, I'm oh. stuck now. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm just- I'm floating. <laughs> open up- Open up your radio, and go to stuck. Where's that? Where's my radio? D-pad up. Uh, I'm stuck. Help me, free me. There we go. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, that's okay. It's just like I got fucking stuck under the goddamn ground. I kind of want to take this over here and get rid of my shit, because there's a lot of stuff. Sure. Yeah, let's, let's just go take it back to bed. Let's go home. We have a nice new van, and yeah. All the cars' handlings in this game are exquisitely amazing. I'm guessing they all just feel like the same fucking Except thing. Trucks. trucks are kind of garbage. So I'm guessing everything else feels good. I'm yes. Step on it already. Don't tell me what to do. You can. Eh. Did you ever deposit that bag of ammo I left in the storage? I did. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I did. There we go, and there. Now, I I just want to point that? something out. Mm, yes. If you have your game volume high and you're using headphones, just prepare your ears for the what's about to happen. I did make the volume a bit lower. What the fuck was that? What did you just shoot? I have a 50 cal anti-material rifle. Cool. Why did it shoot like a fucking assault rifle? I'm... Um, I'm gonna be using this to destroy the play cart and the gun is loud as shit. Alright. So... It will... Attract people. Kind of just destroy everyone's ears if they have... Fucking blasting. Card move in must really fuck up property values. That's a really so, cool humor. What's gonna happen? This is on this is only gonna take a second. But just watch my back, please. Okay. It's hurting, don't let up now. I kinda wanna loot. There we go. That screamer sees me. Go ahead. There's a screamer around. Um, come over here. Hold on. You can loot the plague heart over here. I got To give you plague samples. And you can use those to make the plague heart cure. Cool. In the corner. Wait, what do you mean? The place. Oh god. Right here. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Look at me. <laughs> <laughs> fuck's sakes, I'm stuck again. Help me. I don't know how to help you. I'm just waiting to be put back down. <laughs> oh my god. It said sending you back and it didn't send me back. Oh for fuck's sakes, are you kidding me? I'm still stuck, it said it was sending me back, dude. Oh my god. Is there a way that I can, like, change my character? <laughs> Is that another... No, give me a moment. I mean, I'll be back. If it's keeping you stuck there, I'll get something to fix that.
I'm like stuck in the fucking wall and I can't get unstuck. <laughs> Just keep trying to get out, I'll be back. Alright, get out of there, you son of a bitch. Are you gonna try blowing me up? That was the plan, yes. Will that, like, push me back? It should. But it might leave your character full of shrapnel and probably break his ribs. Yeah, he'll be fine. I have an infirmary I'll for give him a, a reason. Concussion. Come on, let me out. Yeah, this game's like real fucking broken. It's fun, but it's broken. Yeah. It's fun. Alright, I'm gonna try a few things. And if it doesn't work, I don't know what's gonna happen. What's gonna happen is I'm probably gonna quit recording and then reset the thing. And hopefully it'll just send me back to base. I'm on my way. There we go. I got out. Oh, did yeah. you? Okay, so I'm not gonna have to blow your ass. Okay. I just stabbed a screamer in its face. Take that, you little bitch. Oh, an achievement for stabbing that man in the face. Okay, so I'm not gonna just jump over and do that. Hopefully those samples are still there. Did you get... It should be. I didn't take him. Wait, wait. Oh. Thank you. That was a hoot. What's next? <laughs> Just explosions in the distance. Cool. Yeah, that was a lot easier than I expected, but also too, you, you did use a 50 cal. I did. Now we can talk to the neighbors. It's more chaotic and annoying. I feel later in the game it'll probably get a lot more chaotic. I would be careful when walking on that road. As you can see that icon right there. Yeah, yeah, ammo. Is that a feral that I see? Oh, it's a bam. Oh, uh, so you can get like... Go talk to our neighbors. So, yeah, so you can get like bombs and shit too. Okay, that's cool. My dude doesn't get tired that often. Yeah, but I use... Must be something he has. Because I remember in the old game, all the characters that I had would just get constantly tired. Some characters get tired really quickly, and that sucks. Because I'm, I'm running into the same thing, like, not my health. Oh god, what the fuck? Yeah, my, my dudes are really doesn't get tired. Just got tackled. This is a military checkpoint if you want to check it for stuff. I was meaning to go back to that house. I think I just... yeah. I, think I, just, yeah. I just, just was exploring. This game's fucking dark. I kinda like it. Cool. I got a pistol too. Did we leave that van? Did we leave that van? Uh, no, it's sitting at base. You're right, okay. Yeah, let's go talk to our neighbors. I left it there. I'm over encumbered, so we should probably... Like, head back. Head back. 
This is another thing. Um, I think nighttime lasts is way too long compared to daytime. I was about to say, I was like, why the fuck is it still night? Like, it's been, we've been recording for a bit. And, uh, yeah, it's still nighttime. Like, it, the, the night cycles are a bit ridiculous. The night <laughs> and it's extreme darkness for so long. I do want kind of want to change my character again after. It's fine. So that's cool, yeah, you can just like circle strafe them and grab them and backstab. Also, when you roll or dodge, you go through any object, so you can just roll right through them and grab them from behind. <laughs> what the fuck? You have any good ones? Yeah. Later. Who do I talk to? Eh. It goes the same for us. We can roll right through each other. Who do I talk to? I forget who I talked to earlier. Ryan. I can't find the boy. He's the orange marker. I don't want to learn about survivors. Get out of my face. That's cool. I'm happy that you can kill survivors on this game. Ryan's right here. You were talking to somebody invisible for a minute. There he is. Come in. With these plague samples, I can make something that'll cure blood plague if one of us gets infected. Okay. We're happy to share the recipe if you need it. Oops. Oh, for fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just I love that, thanks. I love that, thanks. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just gonna go. Uh, so you can threaten the Enclave, too. Why do they call themselves the Enclave? Well, either... Uh, they call themselves... I don't know, actually, never mind. <laughs> I just love that fire in the wall. Just... Everybody just jumps <laughs> out of her. <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> Someone was in the bathroom where the grenade went off. Yeah, like, I'm slow as shit. I actually love this. Yeah, shows you how smart I am. You're gonna have to give me a minute, because I'm like. What the full. hell was that? What was what? I heard something explode. I don't know then. Oh yeah, people just stay here. They so heal, right? Or do they not heal? Well, sorry. Mm, like, if they're not playing them, they'll just heal. Normally. They'll naturally heal. That's what I was wondering. Yeah. Cool. So, um, you know how smoke grenades worked in Revelations too. Yeah, when you throw smokes on the ground, you, uh... Yeah. Hey, you don't have to worry about zombies getting all up in your business. Yeah, it works the same way in this game. Just toss a smoke and then boom. And they won't know what to do. Cool. I could have hired that dude, but I don't really feel like hiring someone. Don't hire people. Not worth it. Any reasons why it's, it's not worth it? Hurt. hurt. It's a waste of influence, and you could get them infected if you decide to go after a plague hurt. Ah, oh, okay. I'm going to take control of my boy. They're just AI. They, they can't do anything for you other than help you fight. Okay. That's what I was wondering about, if there was actually uh, a bad side to that. Hmm, what else can we do on here? That's fine. I don't fun. personally think it's a good idea. I mean, there's a gun store right here. I'm just looking at some other stuff. House with the side. 
unfinished house construction. Wait, there's a prepper's house. Wait, there's a prepper's house. I don't want to go there. There's a warlord mission. A warlord story mission active right now. What is that? Is that for you? Uh, no, it's for you. You need to go talk to Alexander. That was the blue boy I was playing. Way too noisy. I think Cletus is a warlord. Sounds like somebody's getting their fucking shit smacked up. Alexander's right here. Okay. Yeah, I heard somebody being smacked and I was just making sure nothing that would have happened. Thanks for the intel, I'm on it. Die out there. Mm -hmm. I want to build something here. Where's that? He wants you to go across the freaking county. Uh, do you have any suggestions of shit I should probably build? Mm, do you have a workshop? Mm, no. You should get a workshop because it helps you repair melee weapons and guns. Is it okay if I have it outside? Or will people bitch and complain? Yeah. Okay. Just don't have beds outside. They'll complain. People will just whine and just throw a fucking tantrum. <laughs> Pretty much. It's kind of lame. You can't just, like, camp outside? What, people just can't do that no more? No such thing as camping? Alright, let's go. Mm, hey, you want to see a cool home base? Sure. Get him. I'm gonna drive you to a cool home base. Is that prepper cabin any good? Because, like, Far Cry, it's like those are all the rage. Or are prepper cabins just kind of meh? What do you mean, prepper cabins? There's a prepper cabin behind us that I marked. Have you? Um, oh god. I, I don't know. What's wrong? Lag and explosions. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. I forgot I placed that pursuit trip mine right there. I could have just killed us both. I look a plague heart. Do you want to do it? I don't have weaponry to take care of that, and I don't think you're carrying a gun on you. No, I'm not carrying a gun. But, here you go. Here, here's a, here's a new home base right here, if you want a new base. It looks cool as shit. It's called the bridge fart. This game is, like, lagging up a little bit. Here, stab that guy. Yeah, this place is actually pretty cool. Yeah, nah, no, we can't even move over here if I wanted to. Interesting. Not enough people? Yeah, probably not enough people. Yeah, probably not enough. You need four people and 500 influence to move here. Yeah, that's probably why I can't move over here. You don't have four people. But I just want to show you the space. Also, your warlord story missions all the way across over there. If you look on your map, kind of want to go check out that gun store you were talking about. Wandering horde. Oh yeah, the gun store. Morgan's Scholar. Landing. But yeah, I'm definitely probably gonna try. Hold LB, you can switch seats. Ah, okay. I I'm definitely going to. Uh, Try, try to find a person with the, uh, the sweater thing like that. Like, or a hoodie. I know there's a squid one. I just don't know how I would know that person has an animal thing on. Mm. I don't know. 
I know this one was obvious because on the picture it had fangs. Either way, I got some shit I'm probably gonna do, but yeah, I kinda wanted to just get some zombie killing in. <laughs> just open the other door. <laughs> this was locked, though. Yeah, so should I always just, like... Like, basic search? Or do you hold... Oh, shotgun. Oh, guns. Guns galore. Hello there. I got a mullet. I thought you said you had a mullet. So, my, my Cletus dude's a supposed warlord. Yes. I don't know, is that good? You, you, uh, you know how. Do, the warlord path. you know how I like playing some of these games. Whatever can make me like the most tankiest and like coolest, I'm probably into that. Or is, or is that just for story? It was just for story. It doesn't make your character any stronger. Ah, okay. I think we've scavenged everything this place had. Although, like, the Warlord's special facility is really nice. Uh, what does it come with? You can make tons of ammo for just, like, a few boxes of ammo. Oh, watch out, watch out, watch out! I'm good. <laughs> okay. Got a reset. Alright, let's head back. Let's head back, because <laughs> I got a fuck ton of guns. I think you wounded me. Am I bleeding? How do I check that? Uh, if you open up the inventory and press and go to your skills menu and look at your health, it should say what kind of damage you took. Yeah, it took some type of damage. Kinda hard to see. But I took some type of damage. I'm like minus 15% health. It should tell you what kind of damage you took. I just can't see because of the, uh, what do you call it? TV screen. Uh, no, not the TV screen, just the, um, uh, hold on, just getting rid of stuff. I should probably keep a gun on this I've character. Keep gun? Anybody, because the AI don't use ammo when they fire. Okay. Now you told me that, I'm going to go do that. Oh, they're extremely inaccurate with their bullets. Doesn't really matter though, if it's infinite, that's not a big issue. I'll, t I'll take a shotgun. Cause I got like two carbines out of that. Yeah, I'll take I'll take the shotgun, my fucking... Shotguns were good in State of DK1, but in this one, they're meh. They're meh. Unless you get uh, full bullet penetration. I have like a, a model... Like a model, and I was wondering if that would be any good. Because I have a few guns. I have a hunting oh, rifle, yes. and a pistol, and a shotgun. I was just gonna... You know the sawed-off uh, shotgun from GTA? Mm-hmm. I've seen that weapon with a drum magazine. <laughs> Sounds fucking stupid. And yes, you did fuck me up mighty bad. <laughs> Did yes, I? you did. Like, Sorry. I just looked at my dude, and he's, like, hunched over, and it's like, alright. Well, I know who I'm playing now. No, wait. No. 
You don't know what type of injury he took if you look at his health and stamina. Wait, I can't. Oh, I have to play him? Or I abandon the mission? Yeah, it's his story mission. Shit. God damn it. Hold on, I'll give you something to make you feel like a million bucks. Fuck, man, I didn't even know that. Here, come up. Fuck it, I'm gonna fucking enhance because. There we go. Second degree burns. That's what you gave me. Oh, I gave you second degree burns? 